sure. Yeah. I guess, did you want to, did you, did you look at the shooting percentage today? Well, we did so see that. We, we were just, we were playing games today with that. We were just like, let's see how many times we can hit the post and let's see how many times we can just go an inch higher than the cage. Well, I'm going to tell you something. <laughs> Glenn Clark says when you hit the post that your players belly up to the bar. Uh-huh. And I told him that was totally inappropriate. That's inappropriate. <laughs> inappropriate. But it. that happened many times today. In, I, I have been coaching a lot, a lot of years. I have never had a season where we hit the pipe as much as this group. It's got to be in the 50s at this point. Oh it has to be gosh. in the 50s, and we're not even through the season. Okay. That's crazy. So we're really, I think we're, you know, one of the things, um, you know, Kelly Monte, great player, one of the things that she used to say is you have to teach your, your, your players to hit the net one ball width inside the pipes. Because as the players get better, they're trying mm-hmm. to they're trying to shoot it right inside the pipe, right. so there's no margin of error to give yourself a one ball margin of error. So we're gonna have that conversation. <laughs> they're all gonna listen to this, but we're gonna have this conversation because all I could think about today. It's pretty nice to be able to have this component on a day where you scored 20 goals, by yeah. the way. Pretty nice yeah. for this That's to be the takeaway. Yeah. On a 20 oh. goal day. You know, after a, in a three game week like this, and and we knew we were facing Widener, and when I moved the Washington College game, we weren't sure how you know how how advanced Hood was gonna be. How how Vance Weiner was going to be. So, yeah, I, I didn't get much sleep last night thinking, did I, did I make the wrong move? And, you know, is Thursday going to be too hard? We were exhausted today. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But what I told them is, you know, every time Weiner would start to make a comeback, we would just raise our game to say, uh-uh, you're not coming back. And then look tired a little bit again. But raise our game just enough to get the win and 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 to finish some things. And, and you know, I, I can't be unhappy with that. It takes a lot of guts. We want to talk about that because you guys have been really good coming out of timeouts the last few games. But yes. particularly today, we were really interested in what you did in the second half timeout. In the you, circle. You had that circle Unity going circle. with everybody kind of with their arms around each oh, other. Yeah. <laughs> Can you tell us what was going on there? Sure. sure. So, we, you know, we've worked with uh, Dr. Tiff. Uh, Jones on on um, kind of finding our center of focus and uh, she's been extremely helpful with us to to find common language of when we were stepping out of that place where you know it's okay if one kid doesn't have the focus but it's not good when the 12 out on the field are not working in unison or or together or following the game plan and we're all kind of all over the place so we will from time to time have a timeout like that where we're all we're trying to do we know we're good enough we know what to do we don't need to talk X's and O's in that timeout we need to just recenter what we're, what what the game plan is take a deep breath know that you know absolutely the we is greater than the me and let's go out there and and do our best to just get back under get the game back under control so they responded well to that i thought no doubt. Mm-hmm. No doubt. well you have two great players that you brought up with us I today because i can never choose offense or defense i know so. i know you're soft i'm sorry but anyway. I, 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 yeah. I, just, it's, I but, do this so you get overtime but they were, <laughs> yeah, yeah right yeah, i'm waiting so, for that but, yeah. Yeah. but you know we always discuss who you're going to bring uh-huh. And we actually didn't have time to have that conversation yeah. today. But in my head, I thought you're either going to bring Gabby or Lindsay. I could really and you have a both, so it's perfect. You know, I, you know, hats off to Carly Bose who scored her 100th, and that yes. was great. And, yes. and you know, so many people have multiple goals and multiple cause turnovers and multiple um, uh, draw controls. You know, I thought I thought Sarah Rorty played one of the best games that she's yes. played all season today, and she just keeps getting better game after game. Um, but it was a true defensive unit there that that um, took care of who I think is one of the better one of the best players in the conference mm-hmm. uh, number one from yes. Weiner yes, Kelly so Lynch. so because of that I thought it was in, and Gabby was taking responsibility for her for the majority of the game so I thought it was really important <laughs> that we honor that and, and you know Lindsay just Had she's just getting open everywhere yeah. I, like Lindsay I don't snipe Lindsay snipe I don't, <laughs> that's a, that's a Glennism you that know is, that. that is I, I don't know what do you call me Oh, 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 we can actually use that here on the air. <laughs> Miss Rayleigh. Miss <laughs> Rayleigh, as you should. All right, real quick before we let you go, big one coming up on Wednesday, obviously. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I watched actually a little bit of the, the game before coming out to our game. Um, we just we just got to keep getting better. We're struggling a little bit offensively on where to move. We're all working hard. I'm just not sure we're working in in, uh, in a way that is most effective. So we'll take Monday's practice and really focus in on some seven on seven work. Clear looks good. Mm-hmm. Defense looks good. I just I you know I shouldn't complain. We had all those shots. So obviously right. the attack is working. Right. But I think it can be so much more potent. So that's my goal tomorrow to really look at this film from the game today and just see if we can't help. Um, you know, let's go out and let's score 20 on on Albright. 
right. Let's score 20 on Messiah and see if they can do the same, you know, and, and let's, I think that's how we're going to win. All right. Well, yeah, good luck Thank on you. Wednesday. Thank Always you. appreciate it. And we will well, see you next week. Thank you. Okay. She's Coach Kathy Rayleigh. Let's welcome in Gabby DeJello. She'll be 